Hello, and welcome to another Daddy James Channel about web.com video tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to teach you about Glow Utilities. Okay, in this tutorial, I'm going to uh, tell you how to get a program called Glary Utilities. Uh, now, I haven't put it on this computer yet, but I'm getting ready to put it on there. But it's a good free program. Um, I used to use a program called uh, Advanced Windows Care. I've yet to take it off of here. But uh, with Advanced Windows Care, it wants you to update to the version 3. But this utilities was great until it went to the version 3. And then they call it the Advanced System Care. Um, I tried it out. I did not like it. It, it, it wasn't no good or anything. And that's, for, you know, version 3 because it seems like it cleans your computer like 50%. So I decided to go ahead and get rid of that program, which I am going to get rid of it. I just haven't got rid of it yet. I left it on there just for this tutorial. Um, but anyhow, let's get this new program that I found that works very good and it works better than uh, Advanced Windows Care. Uh, first thing you're going to do is open up your uh, browser, whether you have Firefox or uh, Internet Explorer. <coughs> Next thing you're going to do, you're going to go to download.com. By the way, this is called uh, Fast Dial right here. But uh, I really like that. It. It's an add-on for Firefox. Um, now, uh, once I'm in uh, CNET, I'm going to go to the search area. And I'm going to type in uh, Glary. Okay, but you put in there Glary Utilities. Then you hit on search. Now, once you hit on search, you scroll down. Uh, don't worry about the advertisers. Don't, don't go to them. Just go down right here where it says Glary Utilities. And it should have like the latest version there, too. Over here, you see the editor's ratings. They gave it four stars, and the user ratings they gave it four stars. Um, down here is uh, Glary Utilities Pro. Uh, basically, that's that's just you know if you want to pay for it. Uh, the editors gave it uh, four and a half, and the users only gave it three and a half. The reason why the editor sometimes gives it more than one star is because it's a pay program. They probably paid the editors to do that. Um, most of the time, whenever I'm looking at ratings, I always check out the user ratings. If the user ratings are not so good, then I don't get it. Anyhow, um, let's go to Glary's Utilities and see what some of the users have to say about it. I'll scroll down to user reviews. And they give like pros and cons with them, you know. Um, uh, ease of use, uh, the completeness of the product. Um, cons update process is drawn out. Yeah, that's kind of small. But uh, cons haven't run into any problems yet. Uh, really can't come up with anything. Um, most of the users are saying that, uh, like right here, none found. Most of the users are saying it's a pretty good program. So let's go ahead and, and download this. By the way, it's called Glary's Utilities, but I might accidentally call it Glory. If I do, I apologize. Okay, once it's downloaded, uh, you would just you know, click on it and go ahead and install it. Okay. Uh, click on Next. Accept. Next. Next. Installing. Also, uh, your firewall uh, might come up. Let's go ahead and set that or trusted application or uh, installer or whatever you have to do with your firewall. Okay, once it's finished, it's going to launch it. And here you go. Let me minimize this. Here you go. It's a uh, Glary Utilities. One of the things you might notice is up here at the top, it has tabs. It has like the status, the current status, of it, license status, which is normally not that important. Unless you want to go and update, check for updates. Over here is one click maintenance. And on this one click maintenance, it gives you some choices here. Registry cleaner, uh, shortcut fixer, it cleans up the invalid shortcuts that's on your uh, desktop. Uh, startup manager. Uh, startup manager pretty much uh, means that just uh, when you go to start up your computer, it where you know stop something from starting up with your computer when your computer stops it. Uh, temporary files cleaners cleans out all your temporary files and stuff like that. 
uh, tracks eraser, uh, pretty much clear out your uh, your uh, uh, your internet history and stuff like that. Uh, by default, it doesn't come checked, but you can end up checking. Also, a spyware remover uh, it checks for you know some spyware that's on your computers and stuff. So, <clears throat> also it has more stuff like uh, you click on modules and it has a uh, clean up and repair. It'll do disk cleaner, it'll do registry cleaner, uh, shortcut fixer, fixer, and all install manager. Uh, also, it does optimize and uh, uh, optimize and improve uh, startup manager, uh, me memory optimizer, uh, context menu manager, registry defect. Uh, if you want to know what each one of them means, it pretty much tells you down here on the bottom part of it. Uh, see privacy and security. It offers a lot of great stuff. I used to use a program called uh, um, PC Tune-Up. And <clears throat> the bad thing about that, you would have to pay for it unless you get an illegal crack version of it. Uh, this program here, it seems like it does pretty much everything that the PC Tune-Up does, but it does it for free. Uh, except for one thing PC uh, Tune-Up did do, that uh, this doesn't, it doesn't change the look of your desktop or anything. Uh, to get something to do that you need like PC tune-up or there's a few other programs that you can use to do that with. Uh, also you may notice uh, you know registry cleaner and uh, you've seen that on a one-click maintenance. One-click maintenance is basically you know a quick fixer. So let's go ahead and scan for issues and I'll pause the video while it scans for issues. Okay once it's finished it'll give you the results. Uh, let's see I ain't had no spyware. Uh, track erasure, no problems found. Uh, let's see, temporary files cleaner. Uh, found a lot right there for me. Uh, registry cleaner. Uh, found some problems there. And let's see, shortcut fixer. Got two problems. Let's see what it is. Uh, HT touch diamond and unlocker. Well, thought maybe I had a off of there, but I guess not. So. Let's go ahead and go right here and click Repair Problems. Uh, now your firewall might ask you, you know, uh, it, does it have your permission to do it? So, you know, click yes. Or if you have a firewall like mine. <laughs> Alright, so it is done. And that's pretty much all you have to do. Like I said, uh, this is pretty much one click maintenance. It, you know, just does all that automatically. And then over here, it goes in more depth, and you know you can do more with them and stuff like that. So uh, there you go, there you have it. Glow Utilities. Uh, this is a must-have if you want to speed up your computer, because most of the time, uh, what this does cleans out all the gunk on there and help keeps your computer running smoothly. Well, that's it for this tutorial. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to leave them. If you like my videos and you want to uh, support them, you can do so by subscribing or donating. If you want to subscribe and you're watching my video, you can click right here to subscribe. If you want to donate, click on the Miller Info section and click on the first link. If you're on my YouTube channel, you can click right here at the first link right there. Uh, and click right here if you want to subscribe. If you're not on YouTube and you want to donate, you can go to daddyjamesfilms.webs.com and then click on the links button. It'll take you to my links page. And on this page is a bunch of other uh, links to other softwares that you can try. Um, but you can go right here where it says please donate and it'll take you to my donate page. And you can click right here to donate. Hope you enjoy my tutorial and have a nice day.